Special Olympics of Montana is a growing organization with 2,000 athletes registered in 121 programs from 65 different Montana communities. 18 different sports are offered from kayaking and snowshoeing to soccer and basketball. In the past, nearly every region offers a golf team except Missoula until this past August when the Missoula Otters golf team was formed. I said, why isn't there a team? And she says, nobody's stood up to coach. And she said, what would you like to do about that? And <laughs> Tony Hill and her husband decided to take the leap and volunteer to create a Missoula Special Olympics golf team. They worked with the ranch club and figured out a way to let the team use the facilities. After that, five players took the opportunity to learn and grow in the sport of golf, and Hill says the players have truly bought in. We're very proud of how far they've come, but they've never missed a practice out of 14. And they have worked diligently, enthusiastically, and positively on improving their game. Four out of the five athletes had little to no knowledge about the game and were even picking up a club for their first time. But one player on the team is making strides, not only here in Montana, but across the globe, competing internationally. Recently I went to Macau, which is outside of Hong Kong, and um, competed and I got the gold medal there in my division. And I played uh, well on two days and not the third day. I, the first day I didn't play well. <laughs> Not only is Gleason growing in her own career, but playing a huge part helping out her teammates. Gleason has been golfing longer than she can remember and has been a Special Olympics athlete for an impressive 33 years. She's our star player and she comes to us with lots of experience in, in golf and lots of experience in Special Olympics. So she's a gift to us and helped guide us and we're wishing her luck too. So, it's been a little under a year since the team formed, and they have been practicing since March. When asked what the ultimate goal of the team is, Hill believes it has already been accomplished, but doesn't want to limit how far the players and team can go. I think we've accomplished that goal. We've offered it to five athletes that volunteered to be on the team, and we hope to grow for next year. Our, our goal is to offer it to even more athletes and encourage them and to grow. If anyone out there is thinking about volunteering for anything related to the Special Olympics, Hill has some simple advice. It, you know, anyone who ever thinks about volunteering, uh, you know, you hesitate, do I have enough time? Can I do this? Well, we just stepped in with both feet and took a chance, and we have never been happier to have seen what happens when you step up. Let me win, but if I cannot win, let, let me pray. So what's next for the Missoula Otters? They have their first competition in Great Falls on May 16th.